Elon Musk has been seen entering Twitter HQ for the first time. And this is really big news. So what does this mean for cryptocurrency? What does this mean for your altcoin? We're going to be talking about it in this video. And we also have some other important crypto news to talk about because the market is looking green. So guys, smash the thumbs up button and let's get into this video. So you guys can see Elon Musk entering the Twitter HQ in the US. And uh, it looks like this deal is potentially going to be closed tomorrow. So at the time of making it, it is Thursday the 27th of October today. But have a look at this news article right here. According to Bloomberg, Musk said yesterday during a conference call that his acquisition deal with Twitter would be finalized this Friday, October the 28th, which is tomorrow. And it does look like this is going to go through for around $44 billion worth of money, which is absolutely massive. And what will Elon Musk do once he potentially acquires Twitter? So what's going to happen? The first thing he may potentially do is reduce Twitter's workforce from around 7,000 people down to 2,500 which would be a 75% cut. But on top of that, you guys also know why is this important for cryptocurrency right now? And it is important because Elon Musk does have massive plans to integrate crypto, Dogecoin, other types of payments into Twitter. So we are what we want as crypto investors is we want Elon Musk to turn Twitter from a Web 2 platform into a Web 3 platform with cryptocurrency embedded in it. So this is going to happen within the next couple of weeks, potentially the deal is potentially going to close out tomorrow and that is what you guys need to be aware of in the market in the background of cryptocurrency things are still looking very very good so we have had a surprising turn of events and in the last 24 hours again the crypto prices are surging which is good so pretty much green bubbles all across the charts the prices are looking good and if we do take a look at bitcoin so bitcoin is explaining to us what is happening uh, with the altcoins right now and you guys can see the seven day price window right here and uh, you can see we're trading roughly low 19,000s. We actually dropped down into the 18,700 level on the 21st of October. It was pretty flat. We did get a little bit of a pump up in price on the 23rd, 24th. But just recently, guys, have a look at this. This is the spike that uh, could potentially be a catalyst for some big moves in the crypto space. And we have seen a breakout from 19,300 all the way up to around 20,750 currently. So this is really nice. And this is kind of going against the wind of the economic scene right now. So what we're seeing on a global level is contrary to how crypto is performing. So you can actually see Facebook Meta, they're actually going down in price. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg's company right there, uh, they are missing earnings. You also have Jerome Powell uh, facing political pressure over the mismanagement of the economy, guys. And you guys who know who has mismanaged the economy, it is the central bankers, it is the politicians. They are 100% responsible for the current economic scenes and uh, their policies of printing out too much money, you know, freezing up economies. They are to blame for where we are at right now in the world economic scene. So these guys are under pressure and so they should be. So if you're getting paid hundreds of thousands of dollars, if not millions of dollars to do a job and you're not good at that job, you should be fired in my opinion. And you can see a tweet right here from Michael Saylor. The future of decentralized finance is lightning. So Bitcoin is still leading the way in the cryptocurrency market. Bitcoin is still decentralized. It's still limited. And a lot of people, they have more confidence confidence in Bitcoin than they do have in fiat systems. So you have to remember, again, with politicians, with central bankers, they got that infinite money printing ability. Bitcoin crypto, you guys know, locked in at 21 million can never be any more minted. And uh, things are looking bullish. So watch out for the Twitter deal tomorrow. That's potentially going to go through. Watch out for Twitter going to Web3 platform. And guys, that's a bit of a quick update. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash the thumbs up button. If you guys want to join the quest towards financial freedom, subscribe, hit the notification bell. You can also check out some good links to some crypto exchanges in the description of this video. And I also do exclusive updates on the weekend for the patrons. And if you have questions, you can ask me, DM me over there. But guys, that is a big update for cryptocurrency for today. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Crypto Zeus signing out.